The retirement of the Waterloo Police Chief is quickly approaching. That's right. Chief Dan Trelka announced in September that this would be his last year on the job. KWWL's Colin Dorsey checking in with Mayor Quentin Hart about the next steps in picking a new chief. Well, it's still early in the process, and the deadline to turn in applications was today. The city will start going through those applications now to find a new chief for the city of nearly 70,000 people. This is about the city of Waterloo. This is about the community. After nearly a decade as chief, Dan Trelka is retiring. In the next election, he will challenge current Blackhawk County Sheriff Tony Thompson, who's been in the job since 2009. That leaves the chief seat up for grabs, and it's Mayor Quentin Hart's job to fill it. We'll have uh, an internal um, review board that will uh, take a look at uh, the individual candidates. And my goal also is to see uh, what we can do by having outside community people involved in the process. Waterloo is one of two cities in the state with a strong mayor form of government, meaning the mayor has a lot of executive authority, but Hart says this chief isn't going to be about him. So it's not necessarily the mayor's chief or just the police chief, but this is the uh, chief of the entire community. Since Waterloo has a diverse community with a lot of industry, Hart says the new chief needs to recognize that. You know, diversity, um, industry, uh, we're moving in the right direction in all areas. We're trending forward. So, uh, you know, that person wants to come to an upbeat community, and that's exactly what we have here. Now, Mayor Hart has been out of the office most of the week, so he wasn't able to say just how many applications the city had received by today's deadline. He says we should know more about the selection process, hopefully sometime next week. Colin Dorsey, News 7, KWDWL. All right, Colin, thanks for the update here tonight. We're told the police chief job in Waterloo is going to pay anywhere between $125,000 and $142,000. And the city is still deciding right now who will be interim chief.